Virtual production is basically the interplay between digital content that we might create on a computer and the physical reality of what we're filming. Virtual production is not new. We've been doing it for 20 years. The pandemic was definitely a key factor in the rise of shooting on LED walls. We've always shot on sound stages, but being able to actually shoot a larger portion of what we could previously do. We were lucky enough to work on lots of shows uh, during that period as well. I mean, in fact, I think we were in continuous production for the whole of the pandemic. We've seen a lot of adoption of virtual production inside long form episodic series. We've worked with some amazing directors, we've worked with some amazing companies, and we've collectively seen the tools get much better. We've been continuously improving our methodologies through every single show, which now means we can be quick and the technology just works. New frontiers for virtual production, definitely production design and the art department. I think all of the production designers and art directors that we've been working with are all massively embracing the ability to visualize everything that's in their heads really early on in the process. It's exciting to see how that's developing in our industry. It's probably one of the most important components of what we're doing because it puts, again, them in, in control of the process. We can go back to all of the work we've done in Unreal Engine or all of the virtual sets and we can create new shots from all of that, which then means that we can have a complete director's cut to show to the studio really early on in the process. So there's so much that we do along the way that we can go back to that we started really putting a lot of effort into post and providing that as a service.